I came to Nottingham in 2008 um, and I started my PhD in what at the time was academic radiology, um, which is now part of radiological and imaging sciences um, in, uh, in the School of Medicine. I graduated in 2012, um, I handed my thesis in in 2011, just before Christmas, um, and so finished the PhD process by the middle of the summer. Um, and since then I have been a postdoctoral researcher. I sort of alternate every couple of years between the School of Medicine and the School of Physics um, as the Peter Mansfield Imaging Centre spans both departments. Um, that's been a fairly clean transition. Um, and I'm fairly embedded in the Hearing Sciences um, group in the Division of Clinical Neuroscience and also here in the Peter Mansfield Imaging Centre. So I pretty much just do anything that I can involving MRI and hearing. <laughs> Um, that started out with a three-year contract, which was then extended by a further two years. Uh, and then I applied for a new job, which was a new three-year contract. And then that has been extended by a couple of months at a time for the last 18 months. So I'm now applying for grants, just solidly applying for more money for the next big study. Before I started my PhD, I definitely wanted to be an academic. I think over the course of my PhD, I alternated between wanting to stay in academia and definitely wanting to get out of academia. Um, we've got a really nice group here whereby we uh, collaborate really closely with um, industry and with the media and with policy and, and so I feel that I'm actually gaining the expertise that I will need eventually when I find a job that perhaps is outside of academia. Um, at the moment I really, really enjoy being in academia but it's probably not where I'm going to stay. When I was a PhD student, looking at what postdocs did, um, it, it felt like a very different kind of job to the one I was doing at the time. Uh, now, being a postdoc, I think actually not a lot changed. It probably does depend on what department you're in and, and how far you move from the department that you did your PhD in. And I didn't really move very far. Um, the one thing that probably is a bit different is that you start to need to take responsibility for where your funding is coming from. And um, that, that's probably the, the main change. But again, I think that, de that depends on the department you're in. Not, not all postdocs will find that immediately.